you're just messing around with unity here. Uh, so first of all, I'm going to talk about this equation here. x times e to the negative x squared plus y squared. Right there. And if you graph it, it looks like that, which I thought was pretty cool. So I decided to make a small program in Unity that uh, allows you to graph arbitrary functions on a plane. And it has some pretty cool side effects when combined with the physics engine. So here we go. So here are a few objects sitting on the plane. They just fell down there. And if we gradually uh, add that function that I just showed you to the position of that ball, it warp the space around it. And the ball is constantly moving downhill, but since it's dragging the hill with it, it's kind of like that space-time warping that they described in shows like Star Trek that enable them to do warp drive. That was kind of cool. Beep. And there he goes, gone, off the map. We can also add uh, things that look like gravitational fields in here too. If we just add these guys in here, see they're bending space time around them as well. They might start attracting each other. If we wait a bit and we wait a bit, you can kind of see them moving there. Even though it's pretty slow. Oh, space in the middle starting to get bent. Oh. Come on, guys. I know you could do better than that. In any case, we can start warping through them and mess with their gravitational field. And our trajectory will probably get deflected up that way or something. Maybe over here. Yeah. Nope, still just going off the edge. Uh, but yeah, there you go. Wait. Wait, they're starting to roll towards each other. You can see it. Isn't this exciting? And then, once they eventually get closer, their gravitational well will be twice as deep because they're both in the same place. Here we go. Yeah. So yeah, just messing around in Unity. See ya.